When animals are born, they need to be taken care of and nursed until they're old enough to take care of themselves. But when they are given up or surrendered, humane societies don't always have enough room or volunteers to take care of them on a 24-hour basis. But don't lose hope. Pierre Lemieux of the Kitchener-Waterloo Humane Society explains their remedy for this exact problem. We have a foster care program. So what happens if an animal comes in and they're only, you know, actually it's sometimes as young as a day old, two days old, uh, they, can't, they obviously can't go up for adoption until they're eight weeks old. So we have to uh, find someone who's going to care for that animal because it does require 24-hour care. So since we can't do that here, we have a foster care program and uh, there's over 75 families that are involved. So they'll take in the animals uh, to their home and uh, care for the animals right up until they're eight weeks old and uh, go up for adoption then they have to bring them back here to the center. Foster families don't actually get to keep the animals. They're only allowed to have them and take care of them up until they're eight weeks old. It's not hard to get attached to kittens and puppies. So what is it like when they have to give them back? Foster family Jennifer Hampson and Jade Hickey talk about what it's like having to return their litter of kittens after fostering them for eight weeks. It's hard. You just, you don't want to bring them back because you've had them for, um, for over eight weeks now and you just, you kind of have that little connection with them and you don't want to let them go, but mm -hmm. it's a good thing because you know they're going to go back to loving homes. Mm -hmm. They've all got their personalities by mm -hmm. then and named them. And it's fun to see the people that adopt them, though. The Kitchener-Waterloo Humane Society has over 70 families like Jennifer and Jade that foster not only puppies and kittens, but other animals, too. And they are always looking for more families to help out. For 519 Online News, I'm Courtney Langstaff.